Did I plan on watching a movie tonight? No. Did I know that Tales of Shitty Bug and Clown Noir had come out already? No. I thought it came out in November. So... I guess it came out today? <laughs> anyway, let's watch it. Um, I never finished season 5. I got really close to finishing it after I got my wisdom teeth taken out. But I never watched like the final two episodes the final big hoorah um never watched it but i gathered enough through watching mlb react to the show gotcha life videos that i am good i know what i'm doing and it's been a long time since i did an mlb reaction video so let's get into this i'm excited um i don't like la noir's look it, I'm a giant Cat Noir, Adrian, and Felix fan, okay? And to see Claude Noir with that hairstyle just hurts me deeply because my baby deserves better. Why does Marinette look so freaking good? And Adrian looks like a dumpster. A, a, dump, a literal dumpster. Why? Why? Anyway, let's watch this and react. I'll take one of your butt out. Yeah, I'll take one of your butt out. Okay, so I just got, what, 26 seconds into it. Um, so let's start it over and let's react. In the daytime, I'm Gabriel. Just a normal man with a normal life. Ooh, Alia and Nino. I've never watched the trailer, but Alia and Nino are on his side? I'm sorry. I'm excited. I'm excited. I love, I freaking love when characters go evil, go bad, or just like super dark. Why do you think I freaking love Invincible? And some of my favorite um, episodes of Troll Hunters are just like Jim. When Jim sacrifices himself and becomes an evil monster, like I just, I love it. I love the villains. I love especially when the heroes become the villains and ah. Uh. Ubiquity. I am Betterfly. I give you Betterfly to the parallel world. Betterfly? No, no, guys. I'm a minute into this and I can't. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Betterfly. Betterfly. Betterfly? What the heck? Why? Ooh, okay. We're heading straight for disaster. I knew it. I told you. <laughs> I am sorry. I am so sorry, but you know how much I adore Bark. She is my favorite miraculous, and I have not heard her speak at all. I watched all of season five in Swedish and I didn't really understand what she was saying, and like she barely speaks as it is. So the fact that she's speaking right now, my heart is so full. I love Bark. She's obviously the superior miraculous. Okay, I love Plague, but I'm a dog person, so obviously Bark has has me. Just has me. I can't. The odds. The odds. The odds. Ooh. Monarch schemes. Monarch. Sha <laughs> Noir. Sha Noir. Break on Cat Noir. Trapped like a bug, you. Butterfly. Cat Noir. Yes. I love Cat Noir. Ooh. Ooh. So he's. Music? Oh my goodness! If you've never read fan fiction, that's totally a surprise. But uh huh. Anyway, <laughs> but he's gonna kill one of them. Why? Like, var four. Like, I I don't understand. Why? Why? It may seem like they have more power than you. But they don't Sorry. have your strength. I just, they know nothing about trust. You know friendship. these. Super, you're amazing. You. In my world, I'm hunting. You can't do anything wrong. No one believes in heroes. Everyone is afraid of the supreme. I just, I it makes me so exhausted. Angry. How do you keep from giving up? 
Ew. No! Ew! Adriana Crest. Reveal yourselves! Don't split up. Oh my gosh! Not another one! Not another one! Everything seems lost. It's like your lucky charms. I can't. She's such a stupid, weak character. Oh my goodness. What's that? Oh, that's what it is. She's the female Flash. Like that. <laughs> I was like, what's the name of that show where every single episode they have to give the main character uh, talking to an inspiring speech to get them going? Yeah, it's The Flash. And it went on for nine seasons despite the fact that it sucked. The only reason it kept going on was because of diehard fans and, or teenagers. You know what I mean? And that's exactly what Marinette is. She's the female Flash, okay? She has such a bland... Both of these characters, even Adrian, as much as I adore him, they're very bland characters. Like, Thomas Astruct... He, he, a, Thomas Astruct struck gold, okay? With the miraculous Ladybug world and the show. And for some reason... I mean, I guess he's afraid to fail. But, like, this show... It can't fail at this point because there are teenagers who are obsessed with the children's show. And if you made it more adult and you gave these characters some personality, not just personality for one or two episodes, for the entire show, the lengths this show would go to would be unparable. Like you could have had one of the greatest television shows of the decade. Alongside Troll Hunters, obviously. But you don't because Thomas Astra could not create these characters in a good way. Hi, Mom! <laughs> but the character work and the storyline of Miraculous Ladybug could have been right besides the art of Troll Hunters or any other good television show. And you just have a kid's version of The Flash. And... That's exactly what this is. I, I, I'm so glad I finally remember what the show was called because that's what this is. You know, I never really liked The Flash, but I think this is. I think that's a perfect relation between the two. <sighs> this way, I'll create a second superhero. Y'all, Gabriel looks so good in this other dimension. It's like bad, like, <laughs> like the glasses. It is working for him oh my goodness so first reach so butterfly can turn light wings fall this like way. look at this man he has hair that has volume he has an outfit that doesn't look like he just melted a candy cane and flapped it around his body and he's got glasses i'm just saying he looks good marinette looks good and then you have adrian looking like a recycling bin because I already used I already used the dumpster trash can metaphor for Claw Noir, so he has to be the recycling bin. Which I don't know. Maybe that looks worse. Maybe it looks better. I don't. I. I mean, I'm, I've lost this analogy very far. Anyway. Ladybug, I will destroy you. The thing is, if he had just waited a couple of days until he was positive that the other Ladybug, Claw Noir, Sean Noir, whatever the name is, um, and Betterfly had left, he could have succeeded. I mean, all it takes is a little bit of brains, and the plot convenience trickles away, and you have what? Oh my goodness, a good show? Maybe. But no, 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 you can't have that. Obviously, this is set right like in after, what, episode three of season five? Um, and so even though this is never ever referred to again throughout the entire television show afterwards, you're supposed to believe that this is smack dab in the middle of three and four or whatever episodes. Um, and so obviously, you know, he doesn't win, he dies, and yeah. You found it. Found it. Okay, it is 
the next day. And so before I jump in to what I said yesterday, because it kind of turned into just a really, just really a rant about movies nowadays, you know, um, but let's, let me actually give you an opinion on the show. Um, it was just okay. And I do say that last night, but I mean, ev- just the miraculous, everything could have been better. I did like um, seeing Shady Noir and Claw Noir, nope, Shady Bug and Claw Noir, apologies. I did like seeing them because, like I said earlier, I love the villains. Um, however, I wish we got a little bit more about their world. I just feel like there was so much about their world that we don't have answers to. Like, why is the Supreme evil? Is he just evil for the sake of it? Um, you know, things like that. I just... And, like, what's going to happen now? I just kind of wish we got to see a little bit more of that. But, overall, I thought this was just an okay special. I'm very happy to have watched it because I I didn't know it was coming out. So, it was a really pleasant surprise. Um, and, yeah. Now that I kind of I gave you at least a little bit of a review. Obviously, we still love Cat Noir over here. Um, let's just go to what I said yesterday. A little bit of a rant incoming, but... Okay, that's the end. That was something. I hope you guys liked my little return to these miraculous reactions. Um, I'm going to have more videos coming in November. I need to sit down and edit them, obviously. You know I'm not very good at doing that. But um, this was a really fun surprise. I was not anticipating this until November. I was really excited for it, too, because, like I said, your girl loves the villains. She loves the bad guys, you know? Um, but it was good. It was fine. It it was fine, as all as can be said for every single miraculous ladybug special and most of the episodes in general. It was fine. Um, really cheesy. I don't know. I can't recall like a last episode that was just so much, just filled with so, so much of like nothing. Kind of. I don't really know. I. You guys heard my opinions, you heard my thoughts and stuff like that on this. Please tell me down below what you guys thought of it. Um, did you like it? Did you dislike it? Um, I can't believe they made Adrian look like that in this other universe. Like, why did you have to, why do you always have to make him look so bad and like so weak? Like, come on. Why are we in this era of Hollywood or Paris Wood, whatever Paris is universe is called I don't know I don't watch any Paris TV shows except for this crap um I don't have a very good perception of Paris not just because of this but because also I see the videos of the trash on the street and I'm like hey, I can look like California anyway um so what was I saying oh right so yeah they always have to make Adrian you know the weaker of the two characters no matter how much wrong Marinette does she cannot do no wrong she can climb over the protective fence of Adrian's house sneak into a birthday party for him uh, or a party of any sort um both I think she did both and still come out as a superior love interest for the man and I'm like no no, no, no. And I just don't understand why we can't have a strong male slight character. We can have a strong male sidekick. I'm fine with that. But why can't he ha- why can't he be strong? I'm just asking. I'm so just I'm so tired. That's like one reason why I I I didn't watch Miraculous Ladybug until I had my wisdom teeth out and then I watched that in Swedish because I found it in Swedish on Disney Plus and I was like why not? You know? And like I can't watch the show anymore because I, I can't make reaction videos anymore really because my thoughts are the exact same every single episode mainly. Um, just, they're, it's not very good. It's not a very good show and it really, I don't know. I don't know. I just, the show could be so much. It could be so stinking much and it's not and it's so it's such a shame i feel i really do it's such a shame but i'm gonna end this here because i need to go wash my face for bed 
Um, like I said, this was a very pleasant surprise. I'm glad this came out. I don't have any Instagram or whatever, and I don't follow anything about Miraculous. Um, and so I'm very glad to have seen that this was out. I think what I looked up was, like, um, I wanted to know what Cat Noir looked like in this, for his emo phase. And, because I hadn't really seen anything except for a brief picture. And I was like, that's not what I thought he looked like. And then I found that the whole movie had come out. And I was like, oh my goodness, what? So. So, I'm glad that I watched this. I'm glad, you know, um, is this the best one? Yes, 100% better than Shanghai and New York special. Like this one a lot more. Um, but, yeah. So, I hope you guys just liked me returning to Miraculous, sharing my opinions that are still the same as the last Miraculous video that I rocked it to. And, um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to tell me what you thought of the special down below. And I'll see you guys all in my next video. I am going to be posting stuff about the new Invincible season. We're going a little bit back to my middle roots in this next coming month. Books and reaction and talking about television shows and whatnot because Invincible is coming out and I'm very excited for season two of that. So if you want to watch some more stuff about me just talking crap, good stuff, I don't know. I, don't, I haven't seen the season yet. Um, stick around. And yeah, uh, I'm going to go because obviously I still ramble. That's not changed in the past, what, year and a half since I made my last reaction video. Um, au revoir. Say, ha, mm, au revoir. Salut. Adios. Goodbye. I'll see you guys all in my next video.